Hello from Slovenia again. I didn't paint for four days now because I have my granddaughter and my son and my daughter-in-law here so we have a good time and I wasn't painting so I just want to show you the consistency of my paint for my flower dips. I will do a spiral flower dip again and I will use combination that um, my friend Trish, Trish uh, from Naptime Creations uh, channel like to see so Trish 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 I hope that we can get something nice out of this I will just put uh, my white base and for my spiral dips I don't do a thick layer of base um, white just a thin one I think that it worked better but you can try and see what works for you maybe better because something that it worked for works for me doesn't uh, it don't mean that it will work for you too so it just you have to experiment and uh, try to uh, what is work what works for you the best not for me because when I start uh, uh, watching YouTube videos about pouring uh, sometimes I didn't understand uh, all those uh, artists that I watched because they always say that you have to uh, figure out which pouring medium works for you and so and now I I'm telling the same thing because it's true uh, I tried many many recipes about pouring mediums and all this stuff and finally I found one that it works for me. Uh, you ask me sometimes uh, about my paints. I use, uh, I will use today my artist colors. I love the these paints because they are uh, maybe this one is not the right one or they are shiny they are smooth uh, they are not sponsoring me uh, I just uh, love those paints that's why I think that I will show it to, uh, to you I will use phthalo Cyan turquoise and turquoise. This is a combination that I don't know what will came, but uh, cadmium yellow deep hue, and here I have mid hue because, uh, but uh, in my squeeze bottle is light hue. And for metallics, I will use pentart today. And this is uh, copper and turquoise and gold. Uh, I don't know, we will see. Oh, and I have a little bit uh, of my silver. I will add a little bit of my silver, but this silver is my craft silver. Where is my jar? If you didn't see it yet, but I think that I 
show it a uh, lot of times I think that this uh, my craft this craft paints are similar to the quartz metallics or I just think, think so because when I see effects from this uh, craft paint and if I watched videos uh, when you use um, the card extreme sheen I think that they are they are alike so where we want to start with turquoises or with the reds hmm. I think that I will start with tail of sea and turquoise and I'm still struggling with this um, shape of spiral but I hope oops and next will be metallic turquoise Uh, I want to that I will not forget no I will just do this and then I will tell you and then I will use this cadmium red deep hue what is it I didn't cut off the end of the squeeze bottle so I didn't what is wrong with this I just have a blob in here, I think. Let's see. And what is wrong with this squeeze bottle? I just can't get my paint out. I didn't. I didn't um, <laughs> try this one before I have this I love this combination but I don't know how this will this work in these spiral dips we will see uh, and the copper and now I will do this light turquoise, blue turquoise it's not the green shade, it's blue shade. And cadmium red light hue. And metallic gold on the end. And I'm still not sure how to do this um, outside the petal kind of to get it okay. I really don't know. It, I will 
add silver just around because I like the effect that I get when I do one but uh, I will reuse a canvas uh, I painted it with white but now it's dry so let's see And with uh, these um, spiral dips, I'm not pressing hard, I press just to spread paint because I think that if you spread this too much, you can get a blob of paint and nothing else. Or Maybe I, this is just my opinion, I don't know, but that's it how I did do this. And let's see. Oops. Oops. I didn't lift it okay. But I think that I will leave it. I don't know. Because uh, when I look at it, I see kind of rose shape and maybe sometimes I'm too quick with um, redeeping and uh, that's why I will leave this one because uh, some Some of those um, effects are really beautiful, but I didn't do, I didn't uh, do well with my shape of spiral and lifting and all the other things, but I will leave it anyway because I, I like it. Not completely, of course, but I like it. Ah, uh, oops, I will just put it here it back, because I think that I have to do something here. Mm -hmm. I don't know, but something here is not okay. Maybe I should pull a little bit here. And maybe add white, not blow, but add white here. Uh, this paints levels out so. This will not be a problem when I when it will be dry so I guess 
like dendrites here I don't know why obviously from this uh, tail of cyan green paint really hot in here so I like this combination definitely worth to try again and the skin is gorgeous too I will show you some skins uh, dry skins uh, just in a second I will just pop some of these air bubbles gently because I don't want to melt this um, plastic underneath I just love this uh, part here I will show you just in a second uh, where are they here they are here are some of them Uh, this is from uh, one dip that I didn't uh, publish I don't know if I will because I don't know but I just love some details on this skin and as you know you just pull this off and use it I will show it to you in some video you see but for those who don't know but this is not the right time because I'm I just worry I'm worried that I will um, ruin this and this one is dry too from my last video I just love it you see this shiny shiny gold now I will take you for a close-up wow I just love this color combination three sheets it, it is gorgeous but I have to play a little more with it whoops and what is with my zoom okay see it's kind of uh, rows with gorgeous details if you see it like this I think that it's it is nice but I think that I like the skin again more but I will uh, try to add some skin on my cardboard canvas and made uh, a painting out of it so I'm still practicing this uh, spiral technique too so I hope that I will figure out exactly what is the most important thing. I think that maybe this time my white base it's not okay or this phthalo cyan green reacts a little strange or maybe I shouldn't have had this um, silver around. So, those are my thoughts about what I can do um, different next time, but after all, 
if I look at it now I think that I know I think that I like it I like it so this is it for today and see you on the next one bye